National executives of graduates with disabilities on Thursday morning picketed at the Flagstaff House to register their displeasure over unemployment. The group claims persistent petitions have not yielded the desired result and wants the president's intervention. Government is insensitive for person with disability. Ah! 5,000 persons with disability will be employed in a 2015 federal national address. We are struggling for 40. We are entering 2016 next January and nothing is being done. So for us, it is about time we push government and we push all politicians very hard that when they say something, they should do it. The 11 persons making up the national executive body of the unemployed graduates with disability in Ghana on Thursday stormed the Flagstaff House to demand immediate employment of members a year after completing their national service. The group claimed persistent petitions to the presidency, the Labour and Employment Ministry, Gender and Social Protection to consider employing them have not yielded any results, hence the need to picket at the Flagstaff House. Security officials initially restricted them from accessing the Flagstaff House. After two hours, an agreement was reached and they were allowed in. The group says it wants government to institute a national policy that will ensure all persons with disability employed after school. Presenting this petition is not an end. We are going to fight on and until we have a policy to employ all persons with disability, especially graduates who have completed struggle and completed university and are in the house. A presidential staffer, James Ejeni Mboating, and the Deputy Minister for Tourism, Culture and Creative Arts, Chifa Gomashi, received the petition on behalf of the president. Meanwhile, the group says it will stage a massive demonstration in Accra come December 3 to press home their demand if they do not receive the appointment letters before the said date. Members comprise graduates from the University of Education, Winneba, University of Ghana, University of Development Studies, and some of the country's polytechnics. 